So since the weather is back and forth with rain today, we are working on tracing electricity instead. And we are using a much heavier machine than the one I have, which is working great. So, as you guys have seen, we are working on tracing uh, the walls for the electricity. And for this video, I will send another laser from LaseGo. Uh, this one is a 360 laser with removable batteries. And it comes with dual batteries. Also, it's linked to attach to a tripod or whatever you want if you want to do different heights. But so this comes with two batteries, so whenever you need, you just change your battery. And as with all old houses, nothing is really straight. Uh, but this one goes 360 all around, everywhere around the, uh, the whole uh, room. Uh, and as nothing is straight, what I'm going to use this for is I'm going to use it for the vertical lines. So what I'm doing now is I'm measuring out where we're going to put the sockets. We are placing a bed here, we want sockets on each side of the bed. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the vertical line and I've done some measurements where I want them going in this direction and now I know that I need to place them 80 centimeters up on this green line here. So if you guys are interested in lasers um, you can go check out Lasco I'll put the link below uh, with a discount code as well uh, I think it's 10 percent I'm not sure anyway it's gonna be down in the um, description below for this video and uh, yeah that's it so let's get going So we found this rat here in the house, or he found us, uh, and we are now trying to evict him. See how that goes. So we have another dog 
However, this one has been found as he's uh, probably an escapee. Uh, we're not sure. Anyway, the carbonier is here and we are organizing a pickup so that he can find hopefully find, his home. hopefully find his home or at least somewhere to sleep tonight and then we'll see tomorrow So we went uh, driving uh, to the neighboring village, which is about 15 minutes away, and we found this house, which is quite spectacular. Let me show you guys. Quite a garden. This is the house. Then next to it. Also this, which is beautiful. Alex is working on the facade. I am going to do some preparations for the electricity indoors. Namely all of these cables that's gonna go in. Uh, what I'll do is start removing this piece of uh, the ceiling. And then we are gonna pull a lot of cables in here and then later on we'll build a new channel here for ventilation etc. But I need to remove this so I can start working on these cables etc. Which basically means moving that and uh, put some scaffolding up. So I'm uh, making an absolute mess here. It's a good shoulder workout though. Um, I'm gonna do some cleanup and move the scaffold forward. I've kept this bar here and I did that because I had some sort of idea of uh, 
I'll be keeping that for the next ceiling I'm gonna put in but then again I want to make this as thin as possible for the new ventilation so I think I'm gonna remove that bar and then build a, a new one when I put the new ceiling in with lights etc we're gonna pull cables electricity and everything here and then through here and behind this wall uh, so for now that's gonna be it and apparently I managed to cut open my arm while doing this I didn't notice but just found out uh, so yeah stay safe guys I'm gonna leave you guys with a little bombshell. In the next episode, there will be a famous face arriving to the channel. I'll see you guys in the next one. Ciao. So this is uh, one of the cats that Anna usually feeds. And usually there are some others here, but not today. <laughs>